Yeah. Okay, now is the segment that I have been so excited to share with you guys. It is the skincare haul slash stationery haul. I think I'll first start with the stationery because we love stationery. The big places to go for stationery is Kyobo, which is a stationery slash bookstore chain. Our box used to be a thing, but this time when we went there, it seemed like our box has changed a lot to be more of like a stationery store for younger um, kids, like elementary, middle school. So the, the stationery that I really liked, I found at Kyobo and some of the more like boutique shops, but I was looking for really just like plain journals. So this was one of them, um, but it's just got a nice grid. Um, design. Something fun that I found this time around was these watercolor um, pages. So the first page has like a watercolor paint on it that you can use and then it also includes an outlined um, watercolor page that you can uh, draw on. And then I got two different designs, really cute. What you do is you purchase something like this uh, where you can add water to it and then it's a, like a watercolor pen um, or brush. So this we got at Daiso for a thousand won, which is a great deal. Next we move on to skincare. The most exciting personalized, customized experience was going to the Laneige, um, uh, what's it called, Mothership store? <laughs> what's it called? Not Mothership, there's something. The Laneige showroom in Myeongdong. It was like a nice personalized experience. Of course they have their um, lines there, but you can also sign up online or in person for a uh, personalized one-on-one -on -one consultation where a specialist will help you find your perfect match for foundation. So it came after the experience, they wrapped it up in such cute packaging. And then look at this. And it comes with your foundation. And then you can also pick out a few samples. And so I, I got a cream skin refiner, a toner, and then also a nice serum to try out. They gave us like nice little samples of the Sika mask, which is really popular. Um, she noticed for my skin specifically, this area has a lot of redness to it. So the Sika helps specifically to try to eliminate some of that redness. Um, something that I really want to show you guys. First of all, this is the specialized packaging for the, they call it the Bespoke Neo Foundation. And so they have like a whole machine that basically makes the formula in front of you. So it was such a cool experience. I'll include some video clips of it, but this packaging is so nice. It's glass at the bottom and it has this like magnetic effect to it. So yeah, that's really cute. And then you get to personalize your label. So as you can see here, I just put my name in Korean, but you can really put whatever you want. And then this is my shade that they matched me for. Um, they have over a hundred shades. Highly recommend this experience. It was 60,000 won, but for getting a personalized shade that actually matches you, um, I think it's a worthy experience. And so yeah, I'll try to include the details on how to sign up for an experience like that. You can also visit their Instagram page, which I'll link below too. Oh, with the Laneige. They also gave me this sample of the water bank uh, blue hyaluronic cream, super nice. Really love the texture. Okay, so I'll start with the things that I got from Olive Young. This is the Dr. Dart Vital Hydra Solution Hydro Glow Pads. So these I've been using recently. Um, I'll just put them on in the morning when I'm doing a little bit of work or uh, when I'm journaling, put them on for 20 to 30 minutes. And it's just like a nice little mask um, with just like a calming effect for your skin. My friend, it, it like swears by Dr. Dart. So I wanted to also try out their Sika Pear Cream. Um, Olive Young was having a really nice sale. So you got a one plus one deal 
one for free. Um, but this also, similar to the Laneige Sika sleeping mask, this has Sika in it, which is known to help um, soothe irritated skin and redness. So I'm going to be trying this uh, for the next month or so and seeing if there's any sort of um, effect on it. But I grabbed one of these um, mostly because it says this one first place for a YouTube pick award. So this comes with both a cleansing oil and a cream cleanser. So that's that. This one, I'm going to be honest, I just got because I really like the packaging. It's really pretty. This is from Hanyu, and this is an exfoliating toner in pink plum, so it smells really nice. Um, I've been using it a little bit in the morning when I don't want to do like a full cleansing routine. I'll just grab a pad and put the toner on top and kind of just exfoliate my skin a little bit before putting on essence and uh, cream. Snagged a couple of these. These are my go-to eyeliners. Can't get enough of these. They last for quite a long time and give you that like precise eyeliner um, shape. This was interesting. I bought it just because it was like something I haven't seen before, but this is a True Dimension Radiance Balm. I love Hintz's Instagram page and um, I haven't tried any of their products before, but when I saw this, I thought this was really cool. And it's a balm that kind of gives you more of that glowy effect. So this one specifically um, has more of like a neutral tint to it. Um, this is just kind of giving you this like nice radiant dewy look. I got this. It is Shade and Shadow Palette by Clio um, in the shade number one, Shadow Gallery. And this was like a nice fall palette that I wanted to try out. Um, so it has these beautiful colors here. So it's really pretty. And then I got the perm in Korea. As you can tell, I like don't know how to style my hair yet. So it's quite poofy. But um, I wanted to get some products while I was there for a perm and they highly recommended getting a hair cream. And so this one, I was looking on YouTube, this one has like a really, really nice smell and it seems to work well. I just put uh, like a little dab of it after coming out of the shower on damp hair and it smelled so good that I bought two. So, yes. Let's see what else. Also, things that you need to get in Korea. Pimple patches. These are so great. Um, I know like Cause RX is really popular here in the States, but these are also really nice. You can get them at any kind of pharmacy. So I snagged a few of these. All right, I think we're nearing the end now. This is the Japanese skincare haul. I got the chance to see my sister in Korea. She is currently teaching abroad uh, in Japan. And so she came over to Korea and we spent some time together and she brought these really nice gifts. So I'm also gonna share them with you. Yoshi and I love baths. So she sent a whole bunch of bath salts with really cute designs. So a few of these bath salts. I have yet to try any of these out, so I'll let you know what they smell like. Um, she also brought a really nice um, night repair hair oil here. I took out the packaging already and have started using this one. This is really cool. I haven't seen this um, before, but it's like a hair fixer for your baby hairs. And so it's got, you know, hard wax on it that you can use to fix your baby hairs. I've been using this a lot recently, so nice find, Lena. And then finally, she said that um, colored eyeliner is getting really trendy in Japan, so she sent me this really nice, like, plum burgundy-ish color that I have yet to try, but cute. All right, guys, I think we're going to end this here. We had a lot of fun uh, filming this, and I hope you guys had fun watching it. We'll see you in the next video. Bye. Thank you.